Hi guys, it's Dom from Science Fair Magazine and give me a whole year. We had the great honour of talking to WWE Charlotte Flair about her attitudes to success and how she has changed over the years as a performer. This is of course ahead of the Royal Rumble this weekend. I hope you enjoy. Thank you very much for watching. Hi Charlotte. Uh, nice Hello. To, nice to hear, hear you and see everybody. Um, my question for you is, given that you've... Uh, given the success you've achieved in the Royal Rumble, obviously numerous title wins through your career um, and growing up around success as well. How has your definition of that? How has your definition of success changed from the beginning of your career up until this point? Um, I think it's changed by... You know, there's always that first time you hold your first title. There's always winning the Raw or winning the SmackDown. Um, but then it's realizing, you know, you can exude being a champion inside or outside of the ring. Mm -hmm. And what that looks like and what that means. Yeah. I think learning that and growing as a character with confidence. Mm. Mm. Okay, and what about, have you changed personally? How have you changed personally? Obviously in your own life, you've been through so much. You've, you've experienced the highs and lows of sports entertainment. You've obviously dabbled in entertainment and TV and all that. How have you sort of changed personally as you've, as you've grown and developed? Much thicker skin on some days <laughs> um i think grow i that's a hard one it's like bringing your real self to the performance and what that looks like not being scared to fail like, unless you fail, that's the only way to grow. Mm. Um, like, at first, I'm like, oh, I, I can't fall. I can't slip. That can't be, that can't happen. And now I think it's, when those moments do come, it's like really taking, not taking them for granted and going, okay, how do I learn from this? Or how do I get better? Maybe making or taking bigger risks is key. Mm. 